Hey guys, welcome back to our FCS South Tournament. Today, the Kennesaw State Owls take on the Mercer Bears in Round 1, Game 10. The winner of this matchup will go on to take on the South Dakota State Jackrabbits. Here's Mercer on offense. Here's Williams juking out a few defenders and picks up a big gain on the ground. Jenkins to the air, hits Phillips. And the quarterback for Mercer, his name is Leroy Jenkins. Jenkins again to the air. Corner of the end zone, touchdown, Stevenson, the big tight end. And he is very active in this game. This is a very short video. There wasn't, like, a ton of highlights. But he's third and one for the Owls. Thomas breaks loose to the outside, and he's got the first down up to the 45-yard line. And if you have never seen the Leroy Jenkins video, you type that in, and you go have yourself a laugh. Mercer on the punt return. Johnson, left side. And only the punter is in front of him. He is blocked. But he just got enough of him to slow him down for a teammate. Jenkins looking to go to the air. And he's got Stevenson again. This big tight end is just everywhere. First down inside the 20-yard line. Jenkins again rolling out. And he's going to take off. And he's got it. He is in the end zone for a Mercer Bears touchdown. Seven-yard touchdown run for the quarterback. 14-0. Can the Owls get any production on offense? Here's Thomas. Jukes a man out. Oh, my. And another. Past the 40. Past the 30. And down to the 25-yard line. Made a couple defenders look real silly. Let's take another look at the replay. And your girdle's on the ground still. And your ankle just broke. What a run from Thomas. Second and 12. Keenan looking to throw it. All down. Day. He's intercepted though. Powell catches it off the deflection. His first pick of the game. Bears back on offense. Jenkins. Left side. What a throw to Carter. And he's all the way down to the 46 yard line. It looked like it was going to be deflected. The defensive back just missed it. Jenkins to the air again. And Stevenson wide open. And that was a great block at the goal line. And that springs Stevenson free into the end zone for the touchdown. Take another look at this throw, catch, run. Nice block right there by the receiver. Cornerback never saw him. Stevenson, not the fastest guy in the world, but he's got great hands. Keenan looking to throw it. Takes a shot deep, and there is not a defender in sight as Montgomery is going to waltz into the end zone. For an easy Kennesaw State Owl touchdown. 77-yard touchdown bomb from Keenan. And that cornerback just got toasted. He is like burnt toast right now. Wow. Second and 20 for the Bears. Here's Williams. And he is fumbled. And uh, Paris picks it up as I can't even speak right now. Keenan going to the air for the Owls. Rolling right, and he throws an interception to Powell at the 17-yard line. Second interception of the game at the 17-yard line. What can the Bears do? Jenkins rolling, takes off, past the 40, and out of bounds at the 43-yard line with eight seconds left in the first half. Jenkins going to roll again, and he's going to take off. He's got the first down, Jukes, and he's down. And there was one second left on the clock, but they let it run out. Not sure what the officials are doing right now. They're probably the same officials that officiated the Miami-Wisconsin Orange Bowl. Here's Thomas running left. Nice spin move. And up to the 41-yard line for the first down. Second and 10. Owls looking to make this a one-score game, but Powell with another interception returns it past midfield, past the 40, and he's past the 20, and finally dragged down by the wide receiver, but there was a clipping call on the return. Owls having no luck through the air right now, but the Bears are having all the luck in the world, except for on this play as Robinson picks it off, and he is just going to walk right into the end zone. And there's not even anybody in sight right now as number 86 disappears. But he does high step into the end zone for the easy pick six. 21-14 is the score. That's exactly what the Owls needed. But here's Marks on the kick return from inside his end zone. Returns it up the right sideline. Gets a block past midfield. Past the 40. 
and he is gone. Devin Hester-esque right there, weaving through the traffic. Look at the Bears, 309 yards of offense, only 162 for Kennesaw State. Can they get any more here as they take a shot deep? He's got a man, and he's got it. That's Parker, and breaks a tackle using some strength right there for the touchdown. Kennesaw State makes it a touchdown game once again. But here come the Bears back on offense. Jenkins, option right side, follows the receiver. Great block past midfield and almost broke free. Taken down by a shoestring at the 43-yard line. Williams up the middle, walks into the end zone for the Mercer Bears touchdown. With less than two minutes to go in the game. Owls, first and 20. Over the middle, and that's intercepted again. This time it's Bailey. And he's going to return this one up to the five. What a hit by Keenan. Quarterback letting out some frustration on the linebacker. Little dog and pony show right there, I guess. That is the game. Mercer Bears win it 35-21. to And they get a second round bye. They will go on to play the winner of the Austin P. Governors and VMI Cadets game in round three. They will host that one. But well, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I will see you next week with the North Alabama Lions taking on the Savannah State Tigers and the Jacksonville Dolphins taking on the Stetson Hatters. Until then, I'll see you guys in the comments section below. Take it easy, guys.